Good evening, ladies and gentlemen. It is time for the latest of the most comprehensive breakdown of the biggest news stories in Western Visayas here in Panay News Tonight. Persons were killed in two separate shooting incidents in the city of Bacolod Tuesday morning. Police said an unidentified suspect shot on the head 23-year-old Angelica Montalvo in Barangay Tangub around 7 a.m. According to police investigators, the suspect declared a hold up to Montalvo and her living partner before the victim was shot dead. Two hours later, a senior citizen was shot to death in Barangay 32. Jerome Cientos of Barangay 29 was standing near a Sari Sari store when two unidentified gunmen fired at the victim, hitting him in different parts of the body. Officers of police stations 1 and 8 were still investigating the incidents, the identity of the suspects, and the motive in the killings. Three persons who presented fake negative RT-PCR test results to enter the world-famous Boracay Island in Malay Aklan tested positive for COVID-19. These tourists from Metro Manila were apprehended in the island resort on January 21 and brought to the Aklan Training Center in Calibo for quarantine. They were found infected with the viral disease via swab testing. Meanwhile, the two other companions of the said tourists who also faked their RT-PCR test results tested negative for COVID-19. The House of Representatives gave Tuesday its third and final nod on the proposal of redistricting Iloilo City into two legislative districts. House Bill 8477, filed by Congresswoman Julian Baronda, aims to add a legislative district to help accelerate the metro's growth and development as Western Visayas economic hub and regional center. Under the bill, Haro, La Paz, and Mandoria would be grouped into one congressional district, while City Proper, Molo, Arevalo, and Lapus will be clustered into another legislative district. Aside from the redistricting, the bill also aims to reapportion the Sangunian Panglusod's composition to 16 members. Eight would come from each of the two new legislative districts. And those were tonight's latest headlines. This is Panay News, the number one digital and printed news in the region. Don't forget to always wear face masks and face shields. Sanitize your hands and absorb proper physical distancing. Follow us on Facebook, Instagram, and Twitter. Also subscribe to our YouTube channel. Stay safe. Western Messiah. See you again tomorrow evening.